In this video, I will show you how to find, select, and even edit an existing Kahoot. The developers at Kahoot say they have over 500 million questions available on the site. So this is a great place to start if you don't have any specific questions already in mind. So the first thing you will need to do is you will need to go to Kahoot.com and create a Kahoot account or log into your existing one. To find an existing Kahoot, you will select the Discover option and then search for the topic that you're looking for. Today, I'm going to look for an existing Kahoot on comma usage. Notice that you can see the number of questions in the Kahoot as well as the number of times it's been played. Typically, the Kahoots that have been played a lot more are popular because they were well done. You can open the Kahoot to review and even edit the questions. So I'm going to pick this comma usage Kahoot. And then you can see you can go in and you can review the questions, you can select it, and then even see the incorrect and correct responses for each question. If you're using a pre-made Kahoot, I highly recommend that you at least review the questions to make sure they meet your needs before playing the game with your students. If no editing is required, you can simply hit the play button and the game is ready to be launched. If you decide that you want to edit an existing Kahoot, you simply select the edit button and you'll see it's going to ask you if you want to duplicate the Kahoot. And you do have to duplicate the Kahoot to edit it. In this case, let's say I know that I will have some students playing Kahoot for the first time in my live class, so I want to give them a little more time to answer the first few questions. So I'm going to up the time limit to maybe 120 seconds. I'll double it for the first three questions so students can get the hang of using Kahoot. When you are finished editing, you will just select the Done button and your Kahoot is ready to play in your class. For more information on how to play the game with students, please see the video playing Kahoot in your live class.